Okay, we're here at uh, another property. Check it out. This one is 11 and 0.36 acres. And uh, not sure what what that is. Could have could have been a chicken coop. I doubt it, but uh, could be one in the future, maybe. About four bars with AT and T out here. But this area right here. Says electricity at site. Also says gas in the street, which isn't true. Yeah. This was a grow farm. What they were growing here has been, uh, looks like it's been pulled out by law enforcement. We'll just leave it at that. But it uh, looks like they have an irrigation system set up. I know that there's a well on the property. It's listed at 40 gallons a minute. I don't know if that's accurate, but uh, that's what the listing says. This is a nice, uh, nice area for a uh, garden. Got the boxes already set up. I guess without land glide, we don't know how far back this goes. According to uh, the uh, drone footage, this area right here was right in the center. Oh, okay. So it should go further in all directions. They had a picture of it. They did? Yeah, but I don't. I have no idea where it would be. This uh, property is supposed to be relatively flat. Looks like it does kind of slope down back here though. Yeah, it does slope down. Got some oaks. Got some pretty thick madrones in there. This area right here is pretty flat though. This is right off the right off the gate. Got some deer up in here. bamboo stakes and some uh, some metal stakes over there use I think they were gonna fence this off we got irrigation set up all over the place so the, the well's got to be in this area I 
I know that uh, back in there, I know they've got this fenced off, but back in there is part of the property as well. I would think that the the well would be somewhere. It would have to be somewhere where it's cleared out. I mean, it yeah. They didn't show any any of this in the photos. Yeah, they've got like fencing all along that side. I'm wondering if that's the edge of the property or if that's, they're just trying to get this grow area fenced in. This is a nice little area right here though. Yeah, that'd be a perfect cabin site, huh? Got a lot of, uh, looks like they were going to put a cabin right here. big that is. Let me see if I can walk it off. My shoes are just about a foot. Start over here. Okay, they're eight feet on center. You got one, two, three, so that's 24. You got two, that's 16. That's actually the size uh, cabin that I was looking to make was in 16 by 24. Looks like they've got a little uh, little burn area right here and I've got some lard from something. I'm not sure what this is. Got a lock, no key. This area that's fenced in right here it looks like it's about an acre. I know this property is 11 acres, a little more than 11 acres. Not sure how far it goes in either direction. But I think it goes into there as well. It probably goes out to the, <clears throat> out to the street. Yeah, it was a cleared area like this where they had the picture of the well. But I can't find it. Nope, no in there yeah, that little uh, cabin area right there is 16 by 24. Oh. Gives you good shade. Well, it's good shade. It's it's cool up in here. It's not. It is. Yeah. So you get out there. It's hot out there. But. I yeah. Have, I have no idea where the well would be. Guess, uh, I guess that's out there underneath that. Um, oh, under that little tub? Yeah, probably not. It's one way to find out.
That's it. Yep, there it is. So here's the pump. A lot of deer track up in here. I wonder if they were coming here when they had the munchies. Yeah. <laughs> That's probably another reason why they fence this in. I don't know. But you know, most, at least the ones I know, most pop farmers. They don't only grow pot, they grow vegetables too. So, the deer would have that. Yeah. Oh, and they have a... What is that? That's true. Yeah, peach or apricot. That's a peach. See, it looks like it has some fruit on it. Yeah. A lot of fruit on that tree. It's loaded. Yeah, the water's off right now. I don't know what they were going to build right here. It's almost like they had little sheds all in here. Like yeah. drying sheds or something. You can see here too. This is a 18 by 24 or whatever. And then I'm getting here. Yeah, they had a, quite the operation going on. Yeah, and then these, whatever these posts are cemented in, I don't know. Yeah. This is actually pretty small compared to some of the ones that, like the one I just sold on Christmas tree. Oh my gosh. There had to be 200 of these smart pots. At hmm. least. It was crazy. Clean this up a little bit. It's probably a larger grow area than what I would have set up, but it's already there. It's already irrigated. Probably have some of the lines are probably broken. I have to check all that out, but. It's supposed to have power. To the site and phone i believe but uh haven't been able to prove that i've seen it in the area though so i know it's out here just don't know how close there's about a thousand dollars worth of lumber right there another thousand right there a couple hundred right there under that tree Okay, this is probably the best property that I've seen in California so far. Um, it's totally isolated, but it's only 15 minutes from town. 
uh, has a very large flat area has a pump um, has uh, already an irrigated uh, garden area installed uh, checks a lot of boxes and in fact I after we went back to the realtor's office uh, we sat down and started to run the numbers uh, to see you know what kind of an offer that I could make and uh, turns out that uh, I did not have a large enough down payment uh, you, you need to have 50% down payment for owner financing um, in this area and I only had 35% so uh, it was kind of a non-starter but uh, I'm gonna keep looking that's where we are I'll talk to you guys later